up? This your boy TNT Barbecue. Hey guys, check this out today, guys. I'm doing some baby back, and I got a St. Louis style rib, guys. Yeah, and all I'm using is from SBG, salt, pepper, garlic, ribs, and I'm hitting it with my mop sauce, guys. Yes, I'm hit with the mop sauce. Hey, my web page will be right here, right awesome. here. W dot B B Q T N T dot com. Sell some mop sauce, guys. I'm telling you what, man. I'm really looking forward to hitting these ribs with this mop sauce. But first, let's get down to the steps. What we're doing, okay? I'm gonna bring in, show you this Iowa raised fresh pork, guys. I'm telling you what, man. This is amazing. So let's go. Hit this with some uh, some S V G salt, pepper, and garlic. So this is what I do, guys. I want to use about uh i would say that much pepper diamond crystal i mean i'm sorry 16 mesh black pepper till uh it's not gonna be 50 50 uh probably that much salt probably a quarter of the salt and we're gonna go with a little garlic now a lot of garlic just a little bit of garlic, yeah. And let's get the going, guys. I'm not going to use a binder. These ribs are pretty moist. I'm going to trim this one up just a little bit. I'm not going to... Uh, I'm not gonna do nothing for us skinning them or anything. I'm gonna take this little flap off, that's about it. And that's why I'm gonna line them up. And I'm gonna let it go. with that salt, pepper, garlic. Yeah, baby. Not too heavy. But heavy enough to uh, taste it. I'm going to do the same thing right here. Me, that, that salt, pepper, and garlic really makes the smoke stand out. So the grill we'll be using today is the Louisiana grill. So that's what we're gonna be using today, guys. I'm gonna bring you in while I put these ribs on. Uh, I'm trying to cook around 275 today. So we're gonna get this bark going, 275 on the pellet grill. Let's go, guys. Let's get it done. We're using uh, both sides right now. We're running uh, hickory and oak right now. So that's what we're running. All right, so on this side right here, right in the middle. Get these real smushed up so they can cook real good. I'm trying to get on the way they can cook. And I'm doing the same thing to the St. Louis style ribs. We're cooking both sides of the grill. We're gonna lay it down. 275. We'll bring you in for the first mop here in about an hour, okay? So about an hour, we'll, we'll come in for the first mop, okay? All right, guys, so it's been probably an hour and 10 minutes since I put the ribs on. I think it's time to go in for the first mop. I need to wait to about an hour and 20 minutes, an hour and 30 minutes, but I'm gonna go ahead and mop it now. So let's bring you in and show you how the mop sauce so pour in the bowl. Wanna make sure you shake that mop sauce real good, baby.
Oh yeah. All right. Let it soak up. Let that mops all soak up. Yeah. Got let's see. Oh, that's looking real good. That's looking real good. I tell you what. Oh my Jesus. Yeah. Oh, you do it now. You mop that meat right now. You don't want to not season. Now you want to mop it. Just, just, just make sure you get it all over. Yes. Let's see how these, let's see how these, uh, the baby, they're not looking as nice as the baby bite, but they're looking good though. These are here still way as a little mop, but that's All right, guys, that's the first mop. It's been about mm, two and a half hours. Let's see what we rolling with. Oh my goodness, I think that's done. Oh yeah, that's done right there. I'm gonna hit it with some mop sauce. Oh yeah, that is done. Look at that bark, baby. Look at that color. Oh yeah, that's done. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna just take that off right there. I'm gonna hit it with that mop sauce, take it off right there. Oh yeah, that, 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 that. I'm gonna wrap this up at four and let this rest, okay? Let me take that off. Wrap it up at four, okay? I'm gonna hit it with a little mop sauce. Man, that smells amazing. Oh my goodness, look at that bark, look at that color. Whoa. Man, look at what that mop sauce did. Oh my goodness. I want to uh, lay it down like that. Yeah. Then I'm going to hit it with a little mop sauce. You don't have to use as much mop sauce as I use, guys, but I like the I like the flavor of it. It reminds me of home. So I'm just going to mop it down. Let it rest. In the foil. I'm gonna let it sit in this foil. Let it just rest for about 30 minutes. We'll be cut into those, man. I want them to cool down just a little bit, okay? That's what we're gonna do. Look, man, I'm hungry. I know for a fact this St. Louis style rib is done. So I'm gonna take it off, man. I'm gonna let it rest too. I just wanna be able to eat everything at one time. So I'm gonna go and get my luminal foil ready, get my mop sauce ready, guys. Taking this uh, St. Louis style rib off, and we're gonna see how it looks, okay? Oh, yeah. She flopping. She is flopping. She hot, though. I think I'm gonna put some of that uh, in the wrap. Now, I just do this because. I love the flavor of this mop sauce. But you don't have to do it like that. That's how I do mine, though. I grew up with a very tangy kind of vinegary barbecue sauce. But uh, I'm trying to stay away from the calories of barbecue sauces. So I, uh, I keep everything savory. So that's what I'm doing. Everything savory.
All right, so we're gonna let this rib stay in here and let it just finish uh, resting. Let it rest, let it absorb the flavors of the mop sauce, guys. That's what we're gonna All do. All right, guys, so man, we at the end of the video, before we cut up anything, let's just talk about what we did, man. First, we got some salt, pepper, garlic. We, we get these baby back, got a baby back rib, got a St. Louis style rib, seasoned down, threw it on the Louisiana grill. We got some uh, pecan pellets in there. And I think a little hickory. And guys, you know what I'm saying, man? We hit it with that mop sauce. That TNT mop sauce about an hour and a half into the cook, guys. It did take us number about three, three and a half hours. We had everything ready, man. This put a great flavor on it, man. My co-packer over there, at, uh, you know what I'm saying? My co-packer Ernie. Oh, at John Henry, man. Let me tell you guys, they're a great company. They've been really pulling through. They've been really earning my respect at customer service. So, man, look, man, do me a favor. Go over to their website, man. Pick up some of that Big Daddy Smokehouse rub. Go pick up some of that Smoky Bourbon rub, guys. And you can use the discount code right there, man. All capital letters. Discount code, man. WCJHWEB1953. That's W. C J H W E B 1953. Right here, guys. I'm editing right there. Go get some of those rubs, guys. Big Daddy's Smokehouse Rub and uh Smoky Bourbon Rub, guys. Go get those two rubs. Put that discount code in, man. Get you a good discount, man. So let's get to these ribs, guys. Hey man. And you know, you know where to get this at, guys. You already know. All right, guys, let's, let's go ahead and open this up and let's see what we're working with, okay? Because I like we're finna get a little rain. Open this up right quick. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yeah. We open this up live on camera. Yes, baby. I don't know what that was. Hopefully, that wasn't no gun. All right, guys. So, that scared me. But we're going to see what we got. Not used to hearing that kind of stuff in Iowa. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, man. Oh yes. Yes, D. Mm-hmm. Yes, we should open these up, guys, right here. Oh, man. Now, the color ain't as pronounced as it, as it was on the other ribs, but um, I think it's the steam too much, but that's okay. Oh, yeah. So... Let's get these cut up, guys, and let's see what we're working with, okay? Oh, yeah, baby. Cut now this little baby back now. It took me the first one to get kind of. That's enough for that there. Lost the side with that little baby back ribs. Yes, indeed. Mm -hmm. we got mop sauce. Yes, indeed, baby. Yeah, 
we're gonna do these spares now, baby. These St. Louis. Yeah, I know how to get down with them right there, baby. Okay, yeah, huh. The middle bones out, yes, indeed. Juicy pink color, little bark on them. Mm hmm. Yes, indeed. So, yeah, baby. I'm gonna take a couple thumbnails and I'll bring you back out with a taste test, okay? up some of that Big Daddy Smokehouse rub. Go pick up some of that smoky bourbon rub, guys. And you can use the discount code right there, man. All capital letters. This code, man. WCJHWEB1953. That's WCJHWEB1953. Right here, guys. I'm going to edit it right there. Go get some of those rubs guys big daddy's smokehouse rub and uh smoky bourbon rub guys go get those two rubs put that discount code in man get you a good discount man so let's get to these ribs guys hey man and you know you know where to get this at guys open this up right quick yes indeed, yes Oh yeah, we open this up live on camera. Yes, baby. I don't know what that was. Hopefully that wasn't no gun. All right, guys. So that scared me, but we're gonna see what we got. Not used to hearing that kind of stuff in Iowa. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, man. Oh yes. Oh man. Now the color ain't as pronounced as it, as it was on the other ribs, but um, I think it's the steam too much, but that's okay. Oh yeah. So. Let's get these cut up, guys, and let's see what we're working with, okay? Oh, yeah, baby. Now this little baby back now. It took me the first one to get kind of. That's enough that there. That's the side with that little baby back ribs. Yes, indeed. Mm -hmm. We got mop sauce. Yes, indeed, baby. gonna do these spares now baby these st louis yeah i know how to get down with them right there baby okay yeah huh the middle bones out yes indeed Juicy pink color, little bark on them. Mm hmm. Yes, indeed. So, 
Yeah, baby. There we go, guys. Right there. Look at that, man. Look at that crust on those baby bags. Boy, I tell you what. Man, my spares, they look a little light, but look at that smoke ring, though. Yeah, boy, TNT. The mop sauce, guys, we done did it again. Go check us out. Yes, indeed, baby. Comment, subscribe. All right, guys, so I got my beautiful wife. What's up, baby? How you doing? Mm -hmm. She's not a big barbecue fan because I don't barbecue the old deer. But I want you to taste and see how this mop sauce tastes, honey. So here you go, babe. Why don't you grab that one dude to do a toast? All right, let's toast to this barbecue mop sauce, okay? Boom. Now, I want this is just salt, pepper, ribs, okay? Okay. And mop. So let's go. Mmm. Oh. It's not like a good, savory rib. Mmm. So, what you think, baby? I think it's got a strong vinegar taste, but other than that, it tastes good. A strong vinegar taste? I love it. Mm. So let's taste the, um, these are good, um, St. Louis. Might need a little better. Hey, the mop sauce to all this. Mm -hmm. I think that the mop sauce just cut through the fatness of the spare rib and bounced everything out. Don't you think that's what's going on? Yeah, it must be. Okay. So that's what I did. Look, I, I like the baby backs a little better than I like the, the, the St. Louis. Mm -hmm. But for the, um, the mop sauce is more pronounced on the baby backs Less pronounced on the spare ribs, but for the rib, they're a good rib, ain't they? Yeah. All right, guys. This is T, and this is who? T. We're TNT Barbecue with the a Southern Explosive taste. taste. God, God bless you, and God bless America. America. We, we out of here. here. Peace.